The city has received complaints from business owners and also people who have environmental concerns when they're seeing trash build up in areas such as along the Green River. And just about three months ago, King County cleared about 52,000 pounds of trash from an area where about 100 people were camping near the river. Now, this new proposed ban would ensure that anyone who's forced to leave their camping site will be given shelter. Health and Human Services will then monitor that availability in shelters while law enforcement provides treatment options. Now, the city of Kent says that any filing of charges for unlawful camping would be a last resort. We've lost sight of the fact it's not compassionate to let somebody live in the mud, in the woods, without any sort of services or sanitation. It's not an okay thing. It shouldn't be to anybody. Now, the city of Kent's committee for public safety already approved this proposed ban, so now it's going to go before the full council for a vote here at City Hall tonight, and that meeting gets underway at 7 p.m. There is time for public comment. Live in Kent, Farah Jadrin, King 5 News.